Hello! In this video, we'll show you how to connect your RS5000 to the TV. In the box you'll find the wireless headset, the manual, two audio cables, alternative ear pads, the power supply and the base station. First connect power and charge the wireless receiver for about 3 hours. When you unpack it, it's not yet fully charged. Now connect sound. You have two options here. We recommend to use the digital optical cable if possible, as it's a widely spread connection standard. By now, you'd be ready to go. If this port is already in use, you could connect it to your satellite or cable box as well. And you could also use the TV's headphone output. For this, take the cable with the blue connectors. Just plug it in and turn your TV's volume up to maybe about 90% and you're ready to go. However, if your television's loudspeakers have now muted and you're watching TV with other people, you might have to connect your RS5000 differently. So if your television set doesn't provide the possibility to have the sound over its speakers and the headphone output simultaneously, there's the possibility to connect over RCA and SCART. You can find these adapters in most electronic retailers. Just connect the cable to the adapter and at your television's connectivity panel, make sure to take the right port. It will either say audio output or you'll find a symbol beside it that looks like a rectangle or circle with an arrow pointing out of it. That's the right one. Lastly, refer to your TV's manual to see if any other steps are necessary. Connect over RCA or SCART and your TV's loudspeakers will remain working. The headphone automatically turns on when you use it and off again when you put it down. Here's the volume and on the side there is a button that activates the speech intelligibility effect. Press it once and human speech becomes easier to understand. Now how could the effect be described? Imagine someone speaking in a loud environment. Kind of like what you're hearing now. Give the button a short press and the noise and everything else that is not speech is reduced and dialogue can be easily understood again. At the base station, you can activate hearing profiles to further customize the sound to your preference. Press the button for about two seconds to skip profiles and just pick the one that you like best. Here, you also have the balance if you prefer to have one side louder than the other. Should the headphones seem uncomfortable after a while, maybe try the other ear pads. If the headphone is turned off and not put back on the base station, you'll see the LEDs blinking like this to remind you to charge. You have about 80 meters or 250 feet of range and up to 10 hours battery. Now, you can enjoy your favorite TV programs all over again.